The Alzheimer's Association believes that everyone deserves to live a life with the healthiest brain possible. And as we fight to end Alzheimer's and all other dementia, an important component of our work is to recognize and address Alzheimer's as a public health or population health issue. In order to appreciate the power of public health and the impact it can have on Alzheimer's, we first need to understand what it is and how it works. Throughout history, public health has had an overwhelmingly positive effect on population wellness. While medical care works with individuals, public health addresses health problems across the life course to protect and improve the health and well-being of all communities. Public health acts to change policies and systems to encourage healthy behaviors and reduce the risk of chronic disease, promote early detection and diagnosis, and improve the accessibility of treatment and quality of care. For more than a century, public health action has led to people living longer, healthier lives. And by focusing on advancing health equity, public health can better serve all communities. But as the size of the population age 65 and older continues to grow, we are faced with new public health challenges, including the growing prevalence and mortality of Alzheimer's. It is imperative that public health address Alzheimer's and dementia from a population health level. Health problems become population health issues when the prevalence and costs are substantial, the impacts are serious, and there are public health solutions. Today, there are about 7 million Americans living with Alzheimer's, with annual costs estimated at $360 billion in 2024. By 2050, the number of people living with Alzheimer's is projected to rise to nearly 13 million, and costs are expected to reach nearly $1 trillion. Two-thirds of the staggering costs of caring for those with Alzheimer's and other dementias is covered by Medicare and Medicaid. More than 95% of people living with dementia also have at least one other chronic condition, and dementia can complicate the management of these conditions and is a major driver of higher costs. Additionally, dementia affects more than just the individual living with it. More than 11 million caregivers provide over 18 billion hours of unpaid care each year. And nearly 40% say the physical stress of caregiving is high or very high. There are public health tools and strategies that can improve health outcomes related to dementia for populations in every community. Public health departments collect data that shows the impact of dementia and caregiving in their communities track and monitor trends over time, and implement population-based solutions that promote brain health, increase access to early detection and diagnosis, and support people living with dementia and their caregivers. Public health tools and strategies that can be employed to address Alzheimer's include helping communities increase healthy behaviors that protect brain health, improving patient-physician communication as more diagnostic tests and treatments become available, and ensuring both people living with dementia and their caregivers have access to support and services. Public health has been integral to reducing the incidence, costs, and impacts of chronic diseases, such as diabetes, heart disease, and cancer, in communities across the country. Addressing dementia using the same public health approach is crucial to advancing health equity, accelerating progress for brain health in all communities, and reducing the risk and impact of Alzheimer's across the population.